the new True Stitch from Handy Quilter. Stitch regulation for the Sweet 16. Finally, the new True Stitch, the new Stitch regulation for the Handy Quilter Sweet 16 sit down quilting system is here in Australia. These are the components that come with the new True Stitch. You have the receiver, the transmitter, the coaster, and the magnet. So with the coaster, they've made it so handy. I've come up with the idea that not always will the sender or the transmitter fit under the fabric. There won't always be room for that. Or if you're quilting right off the edge of your fabric, how do we still get the um, stitch regulation to work? So they came up with a coaster idea, and this sits inside. Pops in. And if I was... Uh, yep, there you go. And so that you don't lose it, you can just hit put the magnet on you can see how strong that magnet really is and we would then come around to the screen and as you can see the screen is now changed so we have regulated and manual mode here we can swap in and out in regulated mode it has stitches per inch and you can determine what that length is you can go as low as four stitches per inch if you were say doing basting or as high as 18 stitches per inch which would be great for um, micro quilting but for this exercise we'll be down on 12 stitches per inch. We can adjust it here as well and then we have a cruise speed which means how fast that the needle will sew in a standstill position. These um, features are still familiar, the up and down, uh, the pulsating up and down of the needle and then the needle stop up and down. So now we're going to demonstrate how the stitch regulation works with the true stitch attached to the edge of the quilt. So now we're going to show you how True Stitch will work with the transmitter underneath the fabric and I'm actually going to put the receiver under the slot at the back which is hidden away and out, out of the way of the uh, quilt and you can see that we can't lose the uh, transmitter, that flashing light is very bright under black fabric even, we can see where it is. So we'll show you with um, just hanging on to it, so it's sitting under Kathy's hand. And then she's repositioning, which is not hard to do. So now what we'll do is we'll reposition and we'll use the magnet just like so and that will free up Kathy's hand as well. Okay so we've just re repositioned the true stitch and our quilt to give us more freedom of movement.